Lack of reserves prevents Russia from stepping up its offensive in Luhansk Oblast according to the American Institute for the Study of War, IS. The primary portion of Russia's attack is happening in the Luhansk Oblast. Yet, the invaders lack the resources to scale up and intensify this onslaught. The analysts point out that the primary phase of Russian offensive operations in Luhansk or Blast is still continuing on and that it's likely that Moscow has the uncommitted reserves needed to extend the offensive scope or intensity. Winter season Russian conventional ground forces often deploy and engage in combat in doctrinal formations and units rather than battalion tactical groups or other ad hoc arrangements, according to the Institute's research. The apparent absence of numerous essential tank units indicates that the Russian military is still having trouble replacing equipment, notably tanks lost during earlier offensive operations that were unsuccessful. According to the report, the expert also states that it is quite likely that the Russian forces still maintain reconstructed mechanized troops in reserve. However the deployment of these sparse forces to the Luhansk Oblast frontier is not expected to significantly alter the direction of the ongoing Russian attack, which is most likely to last for some time. And, if they are, could gain momentum when the last reserves are committed, but it is highly possible that this effort will end up falling far short of its goals and without producing benefits that are of operational significance.